just a black one. Sick. Okay, here it is. This is the Beats Solo Pro, the box. So these headphones, they cost uh, around $300 and it's going to have active noise canceling, transparency mode. It has a battery life that can last up to 40 hours if you're not using the noise cancellation mode. And it's gonna last around 24 hours with the noise cancellation on. I have the Beats Solo 3 wireless and those headphones have similar battery life to these. Um, they last over two weeks for me. And uh, yeah, it's, uh, it's great. So here's the headphones themselves. It is made out of plastic, but it has a really nice finish. It's got a matte black finish. It does not catch any type of fingerprint. It looks like metal, but it's not. But the headbands, they are constructed out of aluminum. <laughs> I have to see if it's cold or not. And uh, the ear cups, it's like a pleather ear cups. These are on-ear ear cups and they're quite comfortable. I've been using these for two days now and I'm just making this video today. Yesterday I took these to the gym. They work, they do the job working out, but when I was benching, I was laying down on the bench. These tend to slide off my head. Like maybe it's cause, of, maybe it's cause of the shape of my head, but yeah, they slide off my head. One cool feature, okay. I can't even hear myself. One cool feature about this headphone is when you charge it for 10 minutes, it's going to give you a play time of three hours. It's called fuel charging and it charges via the lightning cable. No USB type C here. But it, it also doesn't have any power buttons to turn it on. All you have to do is flip them open like this. When you flip them closed, it's going to power off. Sorry if the mic quality sounds bad, but I'm using my uh, camera's mic right now. I was using my iPhone's mic earlier. Anyways, I just charged these for 10 minutes it's at 42%, so that's great. There's a button over here, I press it, it goes into transparency mode, noise cancellation. It does the job, it's similar to the AirPods Pro, but I think the noise cancellation and transparency mode is better on the AirPods Pro because the AirPods Pro, they are inside your ears, unlike these on-ear headphones. Maybe if they were over-the-ear headphones, it would, it would sound better. Okay, let's do a quick sound test. They sound good. It sounds like Beats headphones. It sounds good in the bass. These are my type of headphones. I love bass. It has a good amount of bass and it gets pretty loud. Yeah, I mean, they sound pretty clear to me. It, they don't sound crispy. It's not like something an audiophile would use, but they sound good to my ears. For a regular everyday consumer, these would get the job done. These are Beats, you know, it has, it has that Beats signature sound with bass, which I love. Unlike some other headphones, you know, they're not bass heavy. I like these because they're bass heavy. Yeah, I like bass. They sound pretty good, similar to the Apple AirPods Pro. So if you want that quality sound, you can try these on or get these. It's great for working out. Like I like using these to work out. Only problem I have is they keep slipping off of my head whenever I'm benching. Look, look at this. You see, it just falls out of my head. But yeah, these are cool headphones. For $200, you're getting noise cancellation, transparency mode, a 40 hour battery life, and a battery that can charge up to 40% in 10 minutes. It's a pretty good deal. Also, this is going to work great with Apple devices. So yeah, these were the Beats Solo Pro. I'm going to make a full review on these soon. I gotta test them out for a couple of more days or weeks and then I'll get it back to you guys in the next video. If you have any questions, let us know in the comment section down below and I will make sure to answer it in the next video. All right guys, peace.